Assalamualaikum everyone. So today was a very unexpected day. Like unexpected things happened to me. So my brother called me and he said, "Let's go for namaz today." And it was Friday, and I said, "Yeah, fine." I just woke up. I was just having my tea, and he said, "I said so kind of him. He's taking me for namaz today." So I said, "I'll just get ready quickly, and we'll leave for namaz." I just took bath and got ready, and now I'm leaving for it. so this is we are going to the pearl and there there is a mosque queue which is uh, uh, hamad i'll just uh, let you know what is the exact name of that mosque queue and this we are just entering and on the way to the mosque so i'll show you how is it and how beautiful this mosque queue looks and uh, stay tuned stay connected <laughs> This place is entirely different than the rest of the Qatar. It looks like as if you are in European countries, and the color, the brightness, the flowers, the street, everything resemble as if this is a European country. And uh, now we'll step. We'll just searching for a parking, and we'll step out, and we'll show you how this, how beautiful this place is. And this is the hotel which I am inshallah planning to have one one meal in this inshallah one day. And this is a very beautiful place. Like you, if you are like, this looks like as if a uh, tiger or which films film shooting where they yeah I think tiger only. No tigers in tiger. One the tiger that time the way Katrina Kaif used to stand. This I mean it looks like the same building, the same scenario which they have. These water. I think I I saw octopus in this water. Maybe if I am not correct. See see if you can you guys can notice. Like see this one. Yeah. I felt this is what it is, but God knows the water is 
superb clean i have never seen such a clean water ever in my entire life in mumbai and this is like so damn clean water and this place is very beautiful this place have my heart man what do i tell you such a beautiful place such a beautiful place it's like we came early so hence we are just exploring few parts which i have never 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 ever explored so just going through it continue watching So this is the mosque which I wanted to reach and offer my namaz today and this is in Pearl. You can see me, it's very sunny though. But yeah, this is the entrance where females can enter and the other entrance is for the males. So I'm just going to the female entrance and then I'll show you what all is inside. So after entering, this is what you get in the entrance, the basin where you can perform but it's just for show I think yes but it's so beautiful. Now I just remove my footwear, keep it in the rack and uh, I just go to perform my work. This mosque is recently inaugurated. Hamad bin Jasim bin Jabbar Al Thani Mosque, the Pearl Island, makes a significant milestone in architectural landscape of Qatar. Mosque, uh, the total area is 27,720 square meter, which builds up area of 20,898 square meter. This uh, dome towering at the height of 47.30 meters and uh, the breadth is 63.77 meters, like symboling the spiritual significance of the mosque. This is a very beautiful surrounding of the mosque, the landscape you'll see in this. This is where you can perform your vadu and you have both the water, hot water and warm water. I mean hot water and room temperature water. It's like beautiful, phenomenal. This uh, this can this, this is designed to accommodate 2441 males and 247 female worshippers across. It has two escalators while lift including two, two for females, four for males. And lift is designed for Imam. Oh, there's an additional lift designed especially for Imam. It's they are they have parking. Basement parking is also available, but it's a future expansion which they are planning for. And it has a separate female place and male different. It has, uh, it's like amazing. 
it's known as Hamad bin Jasim bin Jabbar Al Thani Mosque, the island tourist appealing, offering visitors and residents alike place for worship and reflection, making it must visit destination as one of the region's most remarkable Islamic monument. So this is how the surrounding the landscape of this mosque looks like. It's surrounded by trees, many fountains and the natural beauty, the flowers, the atmosphere. It's like beautiful. The landscape view, everything is just, like just mind blowing. The architectural uh, marvels of the stone is like mind blowing. It has very good capacity of people and the best part is the security guard is helping us to cross the road. It's so beautiful. Like these people are so helpful. Like controlling the traffic at the same time helping the people to cross the road. This is how the mosque look like and it's amazing. I mean it's like uh, you should visit during night also to see how beautiful the night view is for this mosque. So yes, I'm done with my namaz. And uh, the prayer was for Gaza also, the Philistine also. I pray and I wish that uh, people in Gaza get their freedom very soon, inshallah. The amount of suburb which those people have is commendable. Thank you so much for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe. So this is the different place. I mean, this is where we have parked and I'm just entering into the parking slot. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned. Bye. with this the pearl lulwa the porta arabia namaz and i'll show you my clips which i have taken from that place it's very beautiful so just sharing the pictures which i have clicked thank you so much for watching